वेलकम ऑल ऑफ यू इन द चैनल रॉयस मंत्रा टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस ए टॉपिक फ्रॉम एनसीईआरटी क्लास 10 हिस्ट्री द नेम ऑफ द चैप्टर इज द राइज ऑफ नेशनलिज्म इन यूरोप टुडे इस टॉपिक इज 1848 द रेवोल्यूशन ऑफ द रिवाल रिवालेल्स एक्चुअली in the previous class we had we had uh, discussed we had learned about uh, revolution of 1848 that revolution and this revolution is not the same this is the revolution of the educated middle class people means the professionals businessmen and prosperous artisans uh, in the month of february 1948 in france um uh, the middle class people uh, abdicated the monarchy and uh, and built a republic based a parliament on universal meal service that had been proclaimed at the time there was no independent nation state like germany italy poland austro hungarian empire now these are exist the demanded for the creation of nation state on parliamentary principles the demanded for a constitution the demanded for freedom of the press the demanded freedom for of association the educated middle class professionals businessmen prosperous artisans came together in the city frankfurt what is frankfurt it is a city they formed the boot for all German National Assembly on 18th May 1948 total 831 elected representative marched in a festive procession <laughs> to take their places in the Frankfurt Parliament convened in the church of the Estepol actually there was a place named uh, Frankfurt and at that uh, at that place there was a church called Estepol there all the members that is uh, 831 elected representatives uh <coughs> made a parliament they drafted a constitution for a german nation to be the to be headed by the monarchy subject to a parliament actually they wanted to have a king which will be f- which will be uh, follow the instructions given in the constitution but the king frederick william iv did not at this this not uh, did not uh, give permission he rejected it and joined other monarchs to oppose the elected assembly <laughs> while the opposition of the aristocracy and military became stronger the social basis of parliament eroded the parliament was dominated by the middle classes who resisted the demands of workers and artisans and consequently lost their support <coughs> and at the time what was the position of omen <coughs> omen um had formed their own political association founded newspaper and taken part in political meetings and demonstrations despite that did that despite these they were denied suffrage rights during the election of the assembly when uh, in the frankfurt parliament convened in the charge st4 polls women were admitted only as observer to stand in the visitors so we can tell that at the time women did not get the right to vote and they even not permitted to attend the uh, meeting means uh, they were supposed to sit beside the parliament uh, uh, visitors gallery though conservative forces were able to suppress liberal movements in 1848 they could not restore the old order they came to understand that um, the cycle of revolution and repression could only be ended by grant granting concession to the liberal nationalist revolutionaries <coughs> Hence, in the year after 14, 1848, the autocratic monarchies 
of Central and Eastern Europe began to introduce the changes that had already taken place in Western Europe before 1815. Thus, the serfdoms and bonded labor were abolished both in the Habsburg dominions and in Russia. So, what do we understand uh, in this discussion? Means, uh, parallel to the revolt of the poor, the educated middle class people also revolted and uh, they abdicated the monarch and they built uh, a republic based on universal male suffrage and they demanded for a constitution freedom of press freedom of association for that middle class professionals businessmen prosperous artisans came together in the city of parliament and they made a german national assembly total members were 831 and they drafted a constitution and uh, and uh, represented represented it in front of the king but uh, frederick william ford the southern king of russia did not accept it he rejected it and he with the help of autocracy and military he destroyed the parla parliament and at the time women did not get uh, so much right means they did not get the right to vote the in the parliament while the meeting was going on they or uh, they only stand in the visitors gallery gallery to see the uh, meeting that's all the today's topic if you like this video please subscribe my channel please like my video thank you